Today, we're going to take four separate strips of a pumpkin cut into different sections, glue them together on a skewer in the shape of a plus sign, and make them appear as a single image. Start by downloading the pumpkin template provided. I used white cardstock, but it works just as well on regular copy paper. Cut out each of the four sections. Fold these top two sections in half and glue the back of them together. Don't use too much glue, especially around the edges. You don't want it oozing out. Fold this third section in half and glue it to the back of the first two. Carefully glue the skewer in between the bottom section and the other sections. Take the last section, fold it, and glue it on top of the skewer and the other sections. You need to allow time for the skewer to dry, but double check first that the sections are glued together properly and no sections are stuck together that you don't want to be. That's one reason why you don't want to use too much glue uh, to be oozing out and sticking the flaps together. So I'm just double checking that, okay, that's not stuck to the other flap and that's not stuck. And put it aside and let it dry. When it's dry, straighten the sections out into a plus sign. Quickly spin the skewer by rolling it between your hands as fast as you can. This is trickier than it looks and might take some practice. So why does only one image appear when we spin the pumpkin? It has to do with how slow our eyes work in relation to how fast our brain works. In science, this is called persistence of vision. The images our eyes pick up don't disappear immediately after we see them. They linger. Our brain takes a shortcut and combines the rapidly changing images and merges them into one hybrid image. Hope you have a happy Halloween. Thank you.